Right, it's recording. Right, uh, this is a uh, first live recording. Uh, it's a skirmish, just to show you what we'll be doing on our YouTube channel. So it's a three v three on Exile, uh, just a standard. I'm playing as Cutter, and everyone else seems to be. Oh, that's brilliant. That. No one else seems to be a Covenant. There's two Prophets on the enemy team and a Brute Chieftain and a Brute Chieftain and a Prophet on my team. That's a bit harsh, but it'll be all Covenant. What I like to do as Cutter on this map is I like to get three normal swipe pads and get a second base straight away. Um, I don't really like uh, this base, which is on the very bottom floor. Uh, as you see now, that, this is um, my team, this is probably the most ideal place to do this tactic. Um, Tom has other opinions, Tom doesn't really play cutter, he's more of an Anders, but... It's quite annoying being Anders, because quite often you end up against an Anders or Covenant, which always end up making anti -air. Right here, it looks to be that the, both of the Covenants on my team uh, seem to move in somewhere, but I don't think they're rushing. They shouldn't be rushing, but you never know. They do do that eventually, sometimes. Right. So all you want to do is you want to grab two supply pads on this second base that you made. Try and get four on this base and then get your first reactor up. That's what I seem to do. It seems to work a lot. I really don't understand what these two are doing. You might have called them there. Oh Did yeah. Double flare? Yeah, no, if you do flare on skirmish then it does do that. See is that just shows they will move. Oh look, now he's Right, you might not have seen that, but um he did teleport his uh look there. That is um teleporting. What you do is, if you say spawn a unit out, you send it to this, and your leaders elsewhere, say here, the unit will automatically teleport to the um, Covenant leader, unless there's a disruption bomb, which is that, which, as it shows, disrupts leader powers. Right, you're getting your tech up. Yeah, I'm just getting my first tech. I'll build some more. And you just want to scout around for supplies. See, see what's going about on. To see my uh, scout, the scout yeah. mission. Right, Tom. What do you normally do on Halo Wars? Do you like it? I'd usually get two supply pads, tech, and two supply pads. Upgrade the supply pads, upgrade my base, and start building some units. But depends what I'm using because quite often playing as Anders, as soon as someone sees that you're Anders, they go anti air. So if the Covenant, then you want to be building anti air yourself. Right there, I've just uh, sent these units over to red. Uh, they'll probably, I don't know, they might, they'll probably get pushed back, but, um, we'll see. Right, what I'm doing now is just upgrading my, um, my supply pads to get me a bit more supplies, and then I'm waiting for my, um, barracks to be made, and so then as soon as you do that, you want to get new blood. You're going for ODSTs this game? Yeah, I'm going straight ODSTs. This is how you generally rush with a Covenant by spawning your units in. This is well, it's, it's just a mini battle right here. Oh, 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 oh. 